Hi, my name is Roger. How are you doing? Today we're starting a mixing series. Maybe you know by now that I have a competition going on. The Roger That Song of 2021 competition. That if you record that song, you can win this great plugin from Robotic Bean, the Hand Clap Studio. But I want to show you my way of mixing that song. So let's do that. In this mixing series, we're going to go from this. When I search on YouTube on mixing videos, I get so many annoying titles. I'm not going to judge the content. I haven't seen them all. I have seen a few. But there's like, do this in every mix and the five EQ things for vocal you should do. There's no such thing. Every mix and every recording is different. The only tricks that you can do is to listen and know your tools. There's no such things as the best plugins for metal or the best plugins for hip hop. Maybe there's instruments for metal and hip hop, but there's no mixing plugins for it. They are the same no matter what genre you're recording or mixing in. I'm not saying that my way is the best way. I want you to find your way of mixing by showing you my way. Maybe you get some ideas. Maybe you think that, no, you shouldn't do like that. And that's a good thing. That's a good thing because then you have an opinion of how you want to mix yourself. If you wonder what I'm listening for when I'm mixing, last week I released a video about how to define frequencies. And that is the way I think about frequencies, what I'm listening for when I'm trying to adjust sound in the mix. So what are we going to do this week? Well, first this introduction, of course. Tomorrow I want to show you my Logic template, my stock plugin template. Normally I use third-party plugins mostly, but I want to show you that you can mix with the plugins you have in your door. No matter if you have Logic or Cubase or Studio One or Pro Tools or whatever, you can mix with the plugins you have. You can also download my template and use it yourself if you want to, or if you just want to check it out yourself. Maybe you can get some ideas from my template that you could incorporate in your workflow. Then we're going to set up the template. We're going to import the audio file so we can start mixing. After that, we're going to mix some drums and then some instruments and then some vocals. And lastly, we're going to do some automation and final tweaking of the mix. The audio files from this mix and also my Logic Session is also available for you to download. If you want to mix along with me, you're more than welcome. If you want to do your own mix, that would be awesome. And if you want, please share it with me. I want to hear creative mixes. I want to learn from you. Hopefully you can learn something from me, but I want to learn from you as well. The links for all that are, of course, down below as usual. So hope you will get something out of this week of mixing. Subscribe if you haven't. That helps me a lot. I don't make any money by making YouTube videos. So your subscriptions would really help me out and give me the energy to make more videos. The Swedish word of today. I also showed you this last week. It's a tuner from TC Electronic. A tuner in Swedish is Stem apparat. Stem apparat. And roll you that.